If you're looking for web design inspiration ideas that you can build on your WordPress website, you've come to the right place. Now, all of the designs that we're about to go through can be designed with Thrive Architect, which is my page builder of choice. But if you happen to be building your website with Gutenberg or Seedprod or something else, stick along because I'm sure you'll be able to build them out just fine as well. All right, let's dive in. Hey, if you like web design and building things on WordPress, online marketing, building online businesses, you may want to subscribe to our channel. We put out a couple of really cool YouTube videos each week. So yeah, you're more than welcome to join us. Okay, so the first landing page that I want us to look at is one that I think hasn't received enough credit. And I'm talking about the Coach Focus homepage from Expert. Now, this design came out last year when we released Expert for Thrive Theme Builder. Anyone with access to Thrive Theme Builder can access this page template. And of course, it's fully customizable with Thrive Architect. I particularly like the fact that it does what it's supposed to do. It really puts you and your personal brand in the front cover of your site and helps you build a reputation for yourself. And from a design standpoint, these sticky sections here that stick as you scroll by are absolutely gorgeous, not just because of the fact that they're sticky, which is kind of cool, but because it goes to show that you don't need a whole lot of gimmick happening on your site, distracting users from uh, learning about you and your products and services and ultimately distracting them from converting. It's, it's simple, it's minimal, it's beautiful. Next up, we've got Tonal's homepage. So I don't know if LeBron James owns Tonal or if he's simply working with them, but his face is all over their site, which I'm sure is helping them. Now, when it comes to design, this site is fully built on WordPress and everything about this page can be built with Thrive Suite. But what I really like about this page is their hero section. In fact, I picked out this landing page as one of my favorite ones because of their hero section. I think that they're being really smart at using video right upon landing on the website because it really gives me everything that I need to know about what Tonal is about. Um, you know, the copy on the hero section and the call to action blend in really well too. I can watch the video, read the text in the hero section, press on the how it works button. There's a card popping up on screen right now in case you want to learn a little bit more about how to do video backgrounds on WordPress. So this one coming up is not built on WordPress, but it could be. Let's talk about Tesla's homepage. Look, again, this is one where they don't really have a whole lot of text on their homepage because we all know what Tesla is about, just like Apple can afford to have four or five keywords on each of their sections. Something similar happens with Tesla. Again, a really good use of video backgrounds happening on the hero section. But here, as opposed to Tonal, where they had a static hero section, Tesla has these three little dots that when you click on them, the content of that content box gets updated. And I haven't tried doing this yet, but I'm pretty positive that I could be able to do something like, like this, either using the tab element inside Thrive Architect or perhaps even the pricing chart element. I might post the answer to this inside our Facebook group, but if we keep scrolling down, to me, this page just goes to show how, how important visuals are. Um, you know, I've said this a gazillion times, but good design sells. Good design is going to inspire trust in visitors. And in some cases, web designs are 90% made up of either images or uh, graphics, which is why it's really worth, uh, you know, investing and allocating some resources and having good photo shoots of either yourself, if you're trying to promote your services or your expertise or your courses, or good photos of your product if you happen to be selling product. But from a layout standpoint, this is a really easy to build page. It's a you know, it's literally just a one column layout filled with uh, images stacking on top of each other. So the next site that I've picked is leukemiauk.org. And I think that this is a nonprofit based in the UK that clearly is trying to help people uh, with leukemia. And I think it's an interesting one to analyze because you'd think that a website whose niche is so emotional and delicate that there isn't a whole lot of room from a design standpoint to be playful or creative, but I think they're actually pretty bright about their mission, which is to get people to donate money and using design to serve that purpose. So first things first, um, I love the text highlights. I think that they're being really smart at highlighting words that they know are going to evoke a sense of empathy in visitors. You know, words like better, life-changing, together, fund, uh, you can almost draw a story just by reading those words in your head, which is why text highlights are 
uh, so powerful. And when you put together the story that you just crafted up in your head and support it again with good photos that serve your mission, you're definitely increasing the chances of getting conversions. This site is actually running on WordPress. And if you want to learn more about how you can build a donation form like this one, there's a really cool plugin called WP Charitable that you can check out. I might just do a video soon on how to use it. Okay, these were just a handful of pages that I've come across lately that I really liked or that at the very least they had something in them that made me think, okay, they're being very smart about this or that. Uh, let me know which one was your favorite one or which design you've come across recently that impressed you. Or, you know, if you want to see me building any of these using Thrive Architect, please let me know as well. I truly appreciate your time and I will see you soon. All right, thank you. Bye.